the Amy Robach and TJ Holmes relationship scandal on Good Morning America, everything you need to know, from colleagues to others. Even though both Amy Robach and TJ Holmes are married to other people, there have been many inquiries concerning the state of their relationship as co-hosts of Good Morning America. In images published by the Daily Mail in November 2022, the ABC stars were seen cuddling up, which caused controversy. The pictures, according to the site, were taken throughout the month. During a weekend getaway to a cottage, Holmes was captured on camera stroking Robox behind as she was loading luggage into the trunk. The broadcasters didn't immediately comment on the images or say whether they had separated from their respective spouses. The morning show hosts disabled their respective Instagram accounts, which had numerous images displaying their strong connection, as rumors about them circulated. Holmes also shut down his Twitter account. The relationship between the native of Arkansas and Robach blossomed from a close friendship, a source exclusively told us weekly amid the dispute. They always had a spark, and their shared business trips away from home made them even closer. The informant claimed that the couple was trying to keep their relationship a secret until they were ready to announce. Before the pair's accounts were deleted from the internet, social media users carefully analyzed their messages. Some of their followers noted that Holmes shared a coded message about moving on before the crisis. Crisis. Cry once and end the relationship. It's preferable to crying all the time with them, the excerpt said. He added the caption, quote of the week. Change is never painful, as a prior upload from January 2022 said. What hurts is the unwillingness to change. The former Bet host joined ABC News in 2014, frequently filling in on the morning program when necessary. In September 2020, he started hosting GMA3 on a regular basis. Robach, on the other hand, began her career in 2012 on ABC and began working in the third hour of GMA in March 2020. The couple has always been open about their relationship's professional aspects as well as their bond as conquers. Holmes stated to Resident Magazine in April 2021, Robach and I have similar similar backgrounds and a respect for each other's journeys. We genuinely appreciate where this show is at this point. Although we could have prepared and plotted for a potential concert, this one just naturally developed. The University of Arkansas alum said he was blessed to get along with Robach so well at the time. Trusting each other allows you to be your true and authentic self, he said. They'll keep an eye on you and won't try to make you look foolish or awful. Even if you are poked, it won't be maliciously. This show is simple. When you can perform a show at that level of comfort, it's simple. It just is, you can't coach, instruct, or consult with it. When they were spotted cuddling up to one another at the airport in late December 2022, Holmes and Robach's relationship continued to get media attention over the holidays. Holmes filed a lawsuit two days after the images surfaced. Thanks to numerous work trips, the anchors blossomed a close friendship off-camera, a source exclusively revealed. Together, they traveled to Los Angeles for the Daytime Emmy Awards in London for coverage of Queen Elizabeth II's Platinum Jubilee in June 2022. In preparation for the NYC Half Marathon in the spring of 2022, Holmes and Robach also trained together. According to an insider who spoke exclusively to us in December 2022, everyone around the office could tell there was a spark between them for many months.